So are you using notes to, first of all, let's just make it really, really simple just to make sure everybody that is tuning in here to the podcast, when you say you're doing a deal by using a note, tell everybody what exactly does that mean? So there's different ways to get to that point. So if I'm going to create a note, for example, on a wholesale deal, so, and this is what I've done many, many, many times. So I'll buy the house or I'll control the house either with cash, hard money, you know, seller financing, whatever, it doesn't matter how I get it. And then I'll go out and I'll fix the house or do some kind of uh, rehab to it. It may only be paint carpet. And then I create the, I, I, I create the, I f the finished product and I go and I find, instead of selling it to a retail buyer, I go and sell it to a, uh, a buyer that needs seller financing. And as okay. a result, and who, and who would, who would, what's that buyer looks like? Who, who needs seller financing? Well, Jay, I will tell you this, um, a lot of people. <laughs> and I would say the best way to, the, the best way I can explain it is, is two, two ways. Um, First, first thing I would tell somebody to do is go on Zillow, go into your market. I don't care what market is anywhere in the United States and search a, a county for uh, houses uh, for sale. And Zillow will give you 3000 houses. OK, then go into that same search criteria and change the search criteria and, and look for a number of houses that are offered with seller financing or owner financing. OK, you do that same thing. That number goes down to maybe 15 or 20. OK. So we're talking supply and demand here and the number of houses that are available to be purchased on terms is extremely low. Now, fast forward, I think in your book, you talk about this matter of fact, not to plug the book, but it's right here. And uh, you can't really tell, but I've, I've, I've ear tagged or dog tagged about 45 pages in this. I, it's, it's phenomenal. And anybody that is here needs to get the book and, and read it regardless of what the cost is. So thanks for finally getting that on the, on the market. But, um, so uh, where was I going with this? <laughs> I got sidetracked. Oh, so who, oh yeah, who, I think you talked about it in the book. I think you said maybe up to s some high number of seventy percent of the of the population can't qualify for a traditional mortgage. That's right. Right around eighty percent can't go to the bank and get a mortgage. Yes. So, so that's where we are today. So if you have a limited amount of supply in the amount of houses that are available that be bought through seller financing, and eighty percent of the population can't qualify. That sounds like a good position to be in if I'm controlling the deal. Exactly. Now, 